Probably both. That's a solid unit up front that we went against. It's definitely the best D-line and linebacker core that we've played so far. Uh, they're pretty good. They'll give a lot of people fits on defense. Um, but at the same time, we've had to be better offensively. We wasn't very good as well. Uh, there's a lot of things that we didn't do very well as an offense from starting up front to in the back end with the quarterback. So we have a lot of stuff we need to get cleaned up. And when you go three and out like we did that many times, you kill the rhythm of the game. You completely put your defense in bad situations. And that's entirely unacceptable for what we want. Yeah. Hey, it really doesn't. I mean, it's it's we've allowed them to compete ever since spring. So, in our mind, it really isn't much difference. It's it's a matter of who's getting the reps, and then do you do, divvy the reps up enough that each guy's getting enough work. So when his numbers call, you're ready to go. Uh, obviously, you got to send someone out there. So that guy will take a little bit more reps than the other guy, but it's not far off. So. It's not that big of a deal. It's just a matter of us evaluating Ed daily, seeing exactly where he's at, keep bringing Dusty along as, as, as he continues to keep getting reps and uh, kind of go from there. Yeah, like we're not ready yet. We're not ready yet. We, we, we're still, we're still, still trying to do some basic things, still trying to um, – make our right reads and make a right throw on time with some accuracy. And then I think once we start getting a little bit better feel, I think you'll see more of that come, but we're not ready for that just yet, in my opinion.